you have created uh, something that people don't realize. You have taken an institution, created NYU Langone, but you have taken an institution that was always good, was always good. Was wonderful. But, but you made it the best. Okay. And what I need to know, for people who are trying to figure out how to fix a company, trying to judge a company, I think what you did at that hospital is every bit of what we should be looking for in a private company. How did you do it? Well, first of all, I applied the principles I apply to business right. to that. A great leader, a manager, Bob Grossman, the best. Here, Bob, here's the keys to the place. Get the job done. And then you do what you really need to do to get people motivated right down to the newest employee with the most basic of jobs, you let them know they matter. You let them know they can make a difference. So the same principles we had at Home Depot, right. we have at NYU Langone Health. So the building staff people, the culinary care people, doctors, nurses, pediatricians, uh, patient care tech, everybody matters. Everybody has a purpose. I'll give you one story. We had a patient who had a heart transplant. He couldn't sleep because he was worried about having an artificial, a different heart. A building service fellow went into the room at 3 o'clock in the morning to clean out his pail. He saw the patient was awake and he said, how are you doing? And the guy said, I'm worried. I have a new heart, and blah, blah, blah. The patient care, that fellow sat with him for 30 minutes. The next day, the patient was transferred from intensive care to a general room. The building service fellow went to see him every night. The man wrote me a letter telling me that the care he got from the building service associate was as important to him as the surgeon that did the transplant. Everybody matters. Everybody can make a difference. Everybody matters. Now, and I think that there are a lot of people, Ken, who look at this street where I started, you know, and think that somehow we, and I'm going to say someone who's done successfully, think that others don't matter. Everybody matters. Everybody matters. Uh, but how, how have we failed in getting that across? What's, what's happened? Well, if you're my competitor, I hope you don't know it. But, Gus, if you really can get everybody engaged in the mission, if you can get everybody to believe they can make a difference, not only they can make a difference, but they are the difference, that if you can let them know the three most powerful things in business, a kind word, a thoughtful gesture, and passion and enthusiasm for everything you're doing, everything. Last week, we were picked number one hospital in New York, number three in America. It's incredible. Better than all that, today we're the number one neurological service in America and number one neurosurgery program in America. Those are big things. How do we do it? Reach out to get the best people. Who are the best people? People with passion, people with commitment and with dedication. Obviously, they got to be talented as well. But when you get them with all those characteristics, turn them loose, let them go, and stay on the sideline and cheer them on. Don't miss a second of Mad Money. Follow at Jim Kramer on Twitter. Have a question? Tweet Kramer. Hashtag Mad Tweets. Send Jim an email to madmoney at cnbc.com or give us a call at 1 800 743 CNBC. Miss something? Head to madmoney.cnbc.com.